Hi there, Brian the Blob here, and today's episode is going to be an exploration of our minecart system. So, follow me. Just round the corner from the chocolate tree, we have a terminal station um, of our minecart system, and uh, this track takes us out through, takes us out east through the uh, the swamp here and over to um, the ranch where we have um, we have been breeding cows for leather and for beef of course um, but one of the things that we uh, also worked out was how to build switch point systems so that we can uh, branch off uh, have a decision point and uh, branch off so this first track just takes us way, way east. Um, as you can see, we had a little bit of fun with the architecture here. And, um, yeah, as I said, we uh, worked out a, a design for a three-way junction. We're coming up to the first one here and uh, we now have a decision we can make. We can go to the NPC village in the north or to the ranch and the paintball arena. We're going to come back to the ranch and the paintball arena but let me just take you up to the north first. So this one, um, this line takes us through the hills here and uh, over a river. Have a nice little wooden bridge with the jungle on that side and we just kind of meander through the plains and here we have a stopping point so as you can see we designed this to have um, a place where you can stop you can jump out each of these uh, points has a bed so if it gets to night time and you need a nap you just can't uh, deal with the the bobs at night then you can do that or you can go do a spot of mining um, so yeah we have uh, these stopping places and uh, this one just takes us on further um, so here we're entering extreme hills we have to gain a little bit of height to be able to take the suspension bridge over I'll actually come back and and show you the architecture of the suspension bridge in a in a little bit, but um, we come up, as you can see the extreme hills here we dug a tunnel straight through and um, out onto the other side so this takes us through to the area where we've been building our latest branch mine so here we are, jump out and as you can see if you remember from the previous videos this is where we built our automated um, mine resource collection system um, but yeah let's go take a peek at the architecture this way um, this was the, the big stone bridge that we built I'll uh, probably get a better view from over here takes us across through these extreme hills and um, and then I'll just kind of zip through here yeah I know it's uh, kind of silly to be coming through here without a minecart but um, I did want to just show you the uh, the bridges from the side so We'll just pop down here and uh, take a look. A lot of a lot of fun to uh, just make these bridges and tunnels unique. Um, so yeah, you can see this one comes over this uh, section of river here, and. Uh, all right, we will. Uh, you know what? We will take another minecart. Oh no, we won't. Okay, I thought I had two. 
Uh, I don't suppose there's one in here. No. Okay. We'll just uh, hoof it. In fact, we could uh, go over the top and see the view from up here. Um, yeah, so we've been building out the network um, to... because although, as you saw in the very first episode that we recorded, um, you know, we have waterways and boats, we realized that um, actually the minecarts is a better way of doing it because then you don't have to really think about where you're going, it just takes you there. With the boats you actually have to um, you have to make the decisions yourself. Oh, I don't think I can go that way. Alright. And uh, let's just jump down here. Boop, boop. Okay, so um, yeah, so this one takes us to the mining station here. Oh, sounds like the uh, automated cart system has just arrived. With its delivery, we are going to the NPC village. This, uh, the north there, that line actually isn't finished. You can see the bridge, but uh, but it's not done yet. And uh, this one goes to the, the desert village that we discovered. So when we want to do trading with the villagers, this is where we would go. And uh, we have plans to continue on, but right now this is where the, uh, the train terminates. You can see here that we've just uh, closed it off there. So yeah, guys, um, anyone about? Hi, how are you doing? Oh, okay, written book. I don't have any written books, I'm sorry. All right, well... We will um, do that another day. Okay, so here we are um, at the village, and uh, we want to head back. So we'll just pick up our minecart, drop it on the other end here, and head back. So back to the mining station. And then uh, I'm going to take you over to the paintball arena. Let's see if we can get there. Where's the sun? Okay. We, I think we've got enough time. It's, uh, it's just the, the afternoon here. I want to head out to the paintball arena and the ranch. So back over the stone bridge. And... Uh, then down over the viaduct. Um, yeah, so uh, great news coming up about the paintball arena. We've got a, a great project planned for that. Um, and but uh, I also, uh, when we visit the ranch, I also want to show you the the. Um, underwater cathedral that we built. Uh, that was a, a, a project that got half finished and then was left for a long time. Um, and then we went back and finished it a while a while ago and uh, it came out pretty nicely. I'm, I'm pretty pleased with the result. So we will, we will show you that. Um, so heading out this way. So of course the junction that we're coming up to here will take us or give us the choice of going to the ranch or going back to the homestead. Of course, we want to continue on to the paintball arena and the ranch. Um, in a, another episode, I'll actually show you how to build these three-way um, points so that you can add those to your own servers if you want to. Uh, but for now, this is just uh, an exploration of, of what we have here. You can see uh, workbenches and chests is from where we were um, where we were building the rails and uh, just needed somewhere to create materials and store them. Um, yeah, so this line terminates at the top of the cliff here, and here we are at the ranch, and as you can see from up here, we've got a fantastic view of the ocean. Uh, there, under the ocean, you can see the 
Underwater Cathedral. I'll take you down there in a bit. There's the boathouse and uh, the lighthouse. And here's the um, the summer pavilion at the ranch. We are going to just uh, take the stairs down and uh, it's getting late, so I think we'll take a quick nap and see you back in a moment. Yes, yeah, so from here we can uh, visit the underwater cathedral by just popping along here. We're passing the, uh, obviously you can see the uh, sugar cane that we're growing. We have our ranch there with the, the cows and we have some uh, wheat growing there and actually at the back you can just see the the chicken coop where we grow chickens for feathers and eggs we need to be kept in good supply of arrows of course um, so what we uh, grew here was a giant mushroom just because it was a challenge to do so and uh, we used it as the entryway to our secret underwater passage Eh, it's not that much of a secret if you make it in, make the entrance in a bright red and white spotted mushroom. But, uh, yeah, so um, running along here, this is, wait for it, the cathedral. And it really is under, under the ocean. This um, took a pretty long, this was a big construction project. It took a, took a long time to build and probably the hardest thing was um, getting the uh, the ocean back because you know that uh, the water physics in Minecraft are um, a little bit funky and uh, so it required quite a bit of ingenuity. What I like about the, um, the cathedral is, or one of the things that I like is the um, just the orientation where it's actually pointing to the west and uh, you get a great view of the sunset. Well I will head on back to the ranch, take a quick nap and then I'll see you in the morning. Okay here we are back in the summer pavilion and it's time now to head on with our journey and visit the paintball arena. And off we go. Let's just uh, find the minecart Place it on there, jump in, punch the button, and away we go! Yeah, so the uh, paintball arena was uh, based on... Uh, the design of it was based on a text adventure game from... Uh, oh, a long time ago, 1991 if I remember. Um, in a, <coughs> a text... Uh, multiplayer text adventure called uh, Venue Moo and uh, that was actually it was kind of social media before social media was popularized by Facebook and the web um, but uh, what we did here was we recreated uh, in th glorious three dimensions Minecraft style the layout of the paintball arena and um, just to give you a, a little heads up we're actually planning on making a mini game to be played inside there. It's going to involve wool, it's going to involve um, chests and running around the arena at night and um, uh, it is going to be pretty awesome. In a, uh, in a future episode I'll actually show you how we're going to achieve um, the uh, mechanisms for moving the wool from bunker to bunker. But for now, I'll uh, I'll just leave it at that. So here we are at the end of our journey. Um, in the future, we will be expanding this rail system, probably to go all the way around the paintball arena and um, and beyond. But for now, we will just say good night or good afternoon or wherever you are. And um, here we go. All right, well, thanks for coming on this journey with me, and uh, I hope to see you in a future episode. Bye-bye.